Why is my Xbox One dashboard not loading? If you turn on the Xbox and there's only a spinning wheel on the dashboard, that's a loading bug. You can try to fix it via rebooting. Hard reboot or typical reboot? I'd say power cycle it via the button, and make sure you actually turn it off instead of letting it go to power saving mode. I know that means doing it via the button on the console, not hitting the button on the controller or smart glass app. I did not know anyone actually used that app. You're right though, to try turning it off via the power button, since hard rebooting via unplugging is a last ditch effort. No, the last ditch effort is kicking it to the curb. I'd consider driving it back to the store as a better choice. It is not brand new, so they won't service it. If it won't load after rebooting, hard rebooting is an option. Tell me what I can do other than rebooting. If it refuses to connect to the server after you start it up and the internet connection is fine, there's a couple of things you can try. Like Google to see if the Xbox servers are running. If they are, then go to Home, My Games and Apps, Apps, Settings, check your internet connection and make sure the connection info like the Wi-Fi password are correct. I have not changed that password in ages. Another thing to try is turn on the TV while the Xbox comes up. Just in case you think it is not working when the glitch is really the console not turning on the TV after it is on. I never set it to turn on the TV separately. Sometimes it won't load because of a connection problem. If you've tried rebooting the console, try rebooting the router instead. At least it is something else to reboot. The really hard reboot solution is unplug all the peripherals like the Kinect sensor and internet connection, let the power dissipate, reconnect and turn back on. I wonder what caused this. A lot of people report the green screen of death coming up or rather not going past that screen at random and they suggest rebooting to fix it. When it simply sits there spinning and loading, the root cause initially was a software glitch. And the default tech support solution is rebooting. Yes, but the true solution was updating the system software to fix the glitch. Though you have to get past the loading screen to do that. Reboot, update, reboot again, and hopefully not have to repeat until you've died a couple of times in the game.